Now, we've talked about gold, we've talked about silver, and we're going to dance around water here and there. Okay. But you also have copper, and that's something I don't see copper too often. Let's, let's go into, open the copper top. Yeah, copper is actually the third most important mineral for the body. We use, uh, that's, that's the third mineral in, you know, the line of succession that our body needs. Of course, it's uh, necessary for the creation of red blood cells. We've got a lot of those. Uh, so, you know, if you want to have your, you know, healthy blood, you've got to have copper. Um, copper shows up in, in other places, and I think most frequently where we recognize it is in hair loss, graying of hair, uh, discoloration thing, of skin. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Just hit me up like that, right? My goodness. Oh, man. Go ahead. <laughs> um, so, you know, extremely important mineral. Uh, obviously, we're not getting copper in our diets, and so we need to... We're not even talking about it, because this is the first time I've even had a conversation about topics, about copper, and I've been talking to you for a long time. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, it is, um, it is frequently uh, something that we're lacking, uh, and more so as we grow older, for whatever reason. I think, you know, that's true with everything. A lot of that can be gut problem. You know, we're just not assimilating our food. We get, we get the, the you know the villi in the colon get impacted with, with fecal material. A lot of older people, you know, they have colons. Uh, John Wayne's colon weighed 60 plus pounds. You know, when they did an autopsy on him. So, you know, these are these are things that if we just understand, you know, what is happening. There, there are ways, there are modalities that we can take care of these things and, and prevent these things from happening. But certainly when you have something that's so readily assimilable under the tongue that can get directly into the bloodstream without going through the digestive process, how easy is that? Mm -hmm. You know, then we, you know, we know that we can get these things and uh, certainly copper is something that we should have, uh, maybe not daily, but uh, you know, frequently, two or three times a week. Certainly, in the beginning, if you have symptoms, you know, graying of hair, that type of thing, probably you can use it daily for a considerable length of time, but uh, it's not something you would necessarily need every day once you get adequate amounts. I think the other thing that was helpful for people to realize is that once these um, balance states are restored, that they can actually anticipate, as you're talking about, for example, the graying uh, phenomenon. Uh, graying is a result, yes, of some form of imbalance. Uh, you, the other way, well, gosh, uh, another way of describing that is stress. Mm -hmm. uh, stress is that that's showing up in that way is a sign of the is a, a result of the stress that is. Uh, caused by the imbalance itself. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, it and is. so as you begin to restore the the mineral uh, foundation, uh, and there's enough there. There's also this communication that occurs that is changed by the presence or the absence of the proper mineral matrix. Mm -hmm. And so again, when that, when that's corrected, the stress goes away, but it's also a correct trans transmitting of information mm -hmm. and it turns out that where your, your say your hair starts to show up when it grows out now right. it's no longer given those th those other signals mm -hmm. and you're getting correct printing so to speak in this case of hair <laughs> okay. right mm -hmm. uh, so uh, normalized I guess I'll say okay so you know I kind of liken it to that to the light switches in your in your home mm -hmm. if you turn on the bathroom light it's not going to turn on the kitchen light and so yeah, the light switch to your hair, to your hair coloration, has been turned off for a while. Mm -hmm. So if we can turn that switch back on, good chance your hair color is going to return to normal. Mm -hmm. Gosh, I said a lot of words, and you said, boom, just like that. And it makes <laughs> sense. <laughs> All right. Well, that's why you demand, okay? <laughs> Go ahead. 